Yo, what up, everybody? It's your boy, Cardboard Moses. We're going to go ahead and do 2020 uh, Bowman Hobby half case number one. Uh, all right, so I do need to change this. There we go. And the random on the screen and we do need to random for the Yankees let me put them in here all right somebody's got to win the Yankees Yankees are random thank you freak thank you my dude the Yankees are random, so as you can see, everything's on the screen. Yes, it is. All right, so we're going to copy the names, paste them. All right, I didn't put it in alphabetical order or nothing. It's just in order of when teams were bought through the store. All right, so see everyone's name there. Let's roll the die. We don't do ones or twos, so let's re-roll. Wow, back-to-back -back ones. What the F? Ah, 11. We're going to go 11 times in the random, and as always, good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Thank you, Abraham. All right, so uh, as you can see, the list has been copied and pasted to the random.org. We're going to run on the list 11 times. The top name wins the Yankees. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Money shot 11. Boom. Justin, my man. See what I did there? Congrats, you won the Yankees. Oh, wow. So that's real easy. Boom. Congratulations, Justin. All right. Let's put it in alphabetical order by name. Is that was that a one shot? I think it was. Yup. Wow. So in back to back breaks, the Yankees have been one shotted. All right. So let me go grab the case so we can rip this thing. Fresh case. It's fresh. It's fresh. All right. That was ugly. Got the poster thing here. So, uh, let's do this. You know, I'm just going to grab one from uh, each side. So, grab that, that, that. And boom, there it is. Do people still say that? Boom, there it is. Whatever. Put these away for the second half. And these shall be done shortly. So there's supposed to be more uh, color 
in the hobby, they got the orange hobby exclusives. So here we go. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Thank you, Abe. All right, let's see what we got. Would be nice if I had a, a helper with the pack stacking. Have this thing move a little bit quicker. Where the hits at? Come on. Eh, I could do that, but I kind of kind of like going pack by pack. Autograph. Where are you? Oh, where the parallels at? Where's the color? Come on. It's coming. It's coming. I feel it. Right, let's put it up to a vote. Would you guys rather I go pack by pack or should I do the, the old pack stack and mojo? Freak says stack. Tim says stack. Oh, that's probably the hit right there. Jacob Amaya to four ninety nine Dodgers. Nice. 
Dodgers first to strike. Little son for Raul. All right, so you guys think I should pack stack it then? All right, let's pack stack the rest of this one. Yeah, it'll definitely go faster for sure. Brandon Davis, 125 Cubs. The Witt Jr. Paper Bees. Cracked ice to 150. Justice Sheffield Mariners. Or wait, don't do they call these atomics? Or I think it is atomics. Purple back there. Oh, I think that was the purple. We got a Tim Kate Atomic or Cracked Ice or, you know, whatever you want to call it. It's not numbered, though. Interesting. They usually number these. Greatness, Real American. Greatness, that's what. It's coming. It's coming. Just like that stimulus check. It might, you know, it might take a little bit, but you will get it. Look at that. If that's not love, I don't know what is. Doesn't even like the Bowman. Yet still gets into it to support his team. And more importantly, his Uncle Jesse. All right. The Rip City conglomerate has agreed that uh, pack stacking is the way to go. So that's what I'm going to do. Much love, Brad. Much love, my dude. Mm. 
These things just slide all over the place. Open up the other. Stop moving, sheesh. Almost like, wow, what the hell? Right, put that aside. Let's hit that Super Fractor Auto so I can give away that Bowman First Edition box. There is a bounty out for that Super Fractor Auto. Did you throw pie at somebody's face or something? Dominguez. Paper base Yankees. You did? Nice. Could you imagine what the Dominguez would go for? Is that is that thing still out there? Waiting to be had? Oh dang bread. That's that's some heavy drinking. <laughs> that is uh that is that is that's not, that sounds like something I would do, bread. <laughs> I for sure would get way too drunk at my own wedding. Where's the auto? Where's the auto? Let's see that color.
Ooh, that might be an orange. A Lutz Brewers. I think they call these Atomics. I think Tops is Atomics. Panini Cracked Ice. I, I might have that backwards. I don't know. No one's corrected me yet so far, so. You know what they say? Ignorance is bliss. Be an orange, oh boy. A Poisson Chrome for the A's. Ah, a little Mariners action. Logan Gilbert to 25, the Bowman Scouts orange insert. Auto's got to be here. I believe that's it. Eric Rivera to 299 Angels. The Sparkle Auto. So Angels with a hit. A little hit for Justin. Miguel Vargas, 499 Dodgers. We hit one Dominguez base so far. JJ Blade to 150 Marlins. Brad was 30 when he got hitched. Totally different vibe. Ah, Brad. <laughs> oh, man. You know, dude, honestly, if, if I, I, I think about that sometimes because, you know, I, I had this, uh, I guess you could call her my high school sweetheart. And, you know, she was my first and, you know, the whole shebang. You know, I was her first, you know, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, she would, like, she would talk about, like, us having kids and, you know, getting married and, you know, having this big old house with a big backyard where, all you know, all the kids could play. And, and then, like, after she said, like, kids and marriage, like, like I just, like, my, my mind just went blank. And I gotta, you know, I gotta admit, man, I was, I was scared, bro. I, I was, I, I was scared. So, suffice it to say, you know, I, I, uh, I self-destructed that relationship. You know, I, I wasn't ready to have kids and, you know, get married and all that stuff at 18, you know. So, you know, I tried to, I tried to break up with her. And, you know, we just, we just kept getting back together. Like, I just, I couldn't let her go, you know. I'm not going to lie to you, I, I love the girl. To this day, I still do. Just, like, in a different way. <laughs> and whatever, I, you know, I, I went away to college. And, you know, the long distance thing wasn't really working out. And, you know, I, I just, I kept pushing her away. And I kept telling her, you know, to just do her own thing. And then eventually she did just that. And for some reason, like, I just, I could not handle that. It broke my heart. 
you know, I really thought that she would, you know, stick around until I got my shit together. So when she did it, it was like, oh, damn, that <laughs> shit got real. <laughs> like, I can laugh about it now because, man, like, I, I, I really was not ready at that time. And, you know, not to say that I am now, but I'm a, I'm a firm believer in, in everything happening when it's supposed to, you know, everything happens for a reason. And, you know, she's got like three or four kids now. So, you know, I, I like to think that she's happy. So, you know, good for her. But, yeah, I uh, I was not ready for that. A wild paper wit for the Royales. Rara, I don't know all that, honestly. Um, you know, I'm not gonna lie. The first couple years, bro, I was I was stalker status. You know, I would check all her social media and be like, "Who you talking to? Like, who's that guy?" Blah, blah. You know, and then eventually, you just you just kind of stop. You know. Nice Tariq Skubal to 150 for the Tigres. Doesn't that go to the freak? There you go, freaking nature. Very nice. But yeah, as far as I know, the dude that she got with after, you know, she left me. You know, she she has I think she's got like I think she yeah, she's married to him. But uh she hyphenated. So she didn't change her entire last name to that dude's last name. And now that I mention it, you know, I, I probably broke her heart, too. So she's probably got some trust issues. So she was like, you know what? I'm going to get married, but you're not going to take my whole last name. So she hyphenates. You know, she she put the old hyphenation on there. Not like Madrigal. Madrigal got that last name. No hyphenations to 125 White Sox. See how I bring it all together eventually? I mean, listen, good for her, you know. For me, I, I was not ready. You know, I made the right decision for myself. At the time, I couldn't see it. But, you know, hindsight is awesome that way. So, you know, you know, I'm happy for her. You know, I'd be lying to myself if if I, you know, said I didn't still have feelings for her. I, you know, I probably always will. I'm happy for her. But Uncle Jesse was not about to go out that way. You know, dude, I'm sorry, you know, call me a terrible person or whatever, but I was, yo, I, I just, she was my, like, first serious girlfriend, and then, like, I would think, I'm like, yo, is that, am I really about to get locked down by my first serious girlfriend? Like, hell no. Nah. Like, I need to know what else is out there. Like, e even if there's nothing else out there for me, how am I going to know until I actually, you know, see what's out there? And, uh, you know, I've, I've had... Oh, that's nice. A Dominguez, Yankees, Atomic Mojo. I think I think they are called Atomics. Either way, very nice. But enough about all that. That, exactly, Brad, exactly. You know, dude, I think about all that kind of stuff. I was like, man, how different would my life be if I had stayed with her? Like, all these people that have, you know, come and gone out of my life since her. You know, it's it's just, life is crazy, dude. Life is, life is crazy. But anyway, uh, I don't think we've hit the auto. Oh, no, we did, the Tigers. See if we get some more color up out of here. I want to see those oranges. Oh, snap, Zach. Thank you, my dude. Appreciate you. 
Got the goon squad coming through. Listen, Ra Ra, hashtag living the dream, bro. <laughs> living the dream. I'm getting hungry. But by the time I get out of here, my only options. I might, I might hit up that Taco Bell. I haven't, been, I haven't gone there in a while. Jose Urena to 499 Marlins. What's up, Andrew? Well, it's the same plan we have every night. You know, try to conquer the world. But, uh, dude, you know, I'm here until, uh, until we can't fill breaks no more. We don't, we don't really have a schedule for our breaks. You know, as soon as a break fills, I rip it. So, you know, if, if things slow down and, uh, we're just not filling breaks, I'll call it a night then. Uh, but for the time being, man, you know, we, we've been ripping Bowman, uh, so far. I did a case of Jumbo. I'm doing a half case of hobby right now. Uh, I believe the other half of this case is going to fill uh, right after I'm done with this. I have select baseball in the store as well. Random team style. So everyone has a chance at winning the Yankees. Well, yeah, Jumbo, I don't, yeah, ex exactly what Raul says. Can't do any damage on Jumbo's three or four. Or those mixers because the cases uh, I'm, I'm still missing two cases of hobby and jumbo unfortunately uh, they weren't able to deliver them today so they probably won't come until next Wednesday because of the holiday on Monday there are 12 boxes 12 boxes and a hobby case. So a half caser is six boxes. What well, what's that atomic uh Dominguez going for? And it's not even autographed, Brad? No way, bro. No way. I mean, asking and, you know, what it actually sells for are, are obviously two different things. So there's that. Interesting to see what it'll sell at. The craze for Dominguez is real. That's probably the autograph right there. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious, J. <laughs> so, JMS, well, what are you having for dinner tonight? You, you, know, you got a couple hungry mans in the microwave or, or what?
You had a stove for how? How did I know that it was <laughs> microwavable? <laughs> you know, yo, not for nothing, but the stovers aren't bad. The stovers are not bad. Had a Boston Market Salisbury steak earlier. That sounds pretty good, actually. Bo Dude, Boston Market is hella underrated. Hella underrated. The Stouffer's mac and cheese. You got you got good taste, Andrew. You got good taste. Well, here's an autograph. Dude, this guy's been all over the Bowman today. Luis Patino to four ninety nine Padres. Where are the Padres? Dude Raul did Raul buy the Padres in like all the breaks? It is uh autograph to four ninety nine. Oh, you did, Raul. Nice, very nice. Your Boston market is so underrated, bro. And I don't know if they do this uh, where y'all are from, but at least down here, like let's say you bought Boston market on like a Thursday. In the receipt, they'll be like, oh, get, you know, get a free meal on us if you come in on Saturday. Gets me every time. Alvaro Sejas to 499 Cardinals. I mean, let me ch let me check on that. Numbered, numbered, numbered. Yep, so far every autograph has been numbered. Good eye. They got orange chicken at Boston Market now? What? That is, uh, I've never heard of that. You know, they usually got the good old just, you know, chicken, you know, mac and cheese. You got your cornbread, your, your, your mashed taters. Jordan Belazovic, 499 Twins. Well, yeah, JMS, you know, like I said, there's, there's more colors uh, or parallels in hobby. But you do get more autos in the jumbo, so there's a there's a give and take there, if you will. Yeah, that guy looks like he's constipated. <laughs> uh, I entertain myself. You got the duck face on there. A little atomic action for Rutherford of the White Sox. Uh, Andrew, that is correct. That is correct, Andrew. I uh, I did put a a little notice in the title and in the description for that. Uh, I'll have my the rest of my jumbo and hobby cases uh, coming in on Wednesday. But you know, it's it's happening all over, man. You know. Uh, Tops is only shipping about 25% of their Bowman cases, uh, you know, today, or I should say Thursday and today. So, you know, it, it's not just me, you know, I want to say basically every breaker, uh, you know, still has some cases coming their way. What Tigers card freak? The one I hit for you? The autograph? Is that what you're uh, talking about? 
I mean, JMS, don't don't I always? Don't I always? Very nice, freak. Very nice. Are you looking to flip it, or are you gonna keep that in the old uh, collection? Gonna flip, flip, flip. Uh, I don't know wh wh where is hobby number two at right now. I think uh, what is it, four team, four teams left or something like that. Yeah, that'll definitely fill tonight. It'll probably fill uh, before this break is done. I have uh, two boxes left. We also have select baseball in the store, random team style. Where everyone has a shot at uh, getting the Yankees in that. There's some nice stuff in that select. They got those jumbo patches. You know, good autographs. Doesn't have the logos. But select baseball sells very well. If you are looking to flip stuff. What design is this? Really cool. Two left. Ah, oh, that's the ninety Bowman Mojo. I like, I like the design. Very nice. I also like the throwback Bowman logo on there. Not necessarily T White. I, I I basically got a third of what I was supposed to get. I got one case of hobby and jumbo each, uh, but they weren't able to mail out the rest of my stuff on time. So yeah, it's it's exactly as JMS says. Tops is having issues, uh, you know, with deliveries just overall in general. You know, because of the pandemic. Andrew says he got the Rangers at number two, my dude. So with that being said, Andrew, I got two words for you. Mod Hammer! Welcome to the Rib City family, uh, Andrew. Appreciate you, dude. Thank you for buying into our breaks. As soon as we fill uh, that break, we will rip it. Thank you, Tim. Thank you, Tim. Indians and Red Sox are left at number two. Oh, that, that'll be gone. Gotcha, Andrew. Gotcha. I mean, I, I you know, because usually returning customers or, or just customers in general have that wrench next to their uh, screen name. So I just automatically assume if I don't see that wrench, then, you know, you're a new customer. You know what I mean? But anyways, appreciate you, my dude. No. That could have been terrible. All right. Let me look through these first. 
And Bowman, I, I hear you loud and clear. I'm, I'm going to leave you that way. I'm not going to touch you. I'm not going to ruffle the feathers anymore. All right. These look good so far. Thank you, Cardboard Gods. Dodge the bullet on that one. All right, this stack is getting a little high, so. <clears throat> Get my secret weapon. I need some water. <clears throat> Give me a second, guys. I'm sorry. <clears throat> back in the game all right it bro jms oh i will cry bro i will cry well here's the auto what yo that might be the greatest thing i've ever seen has anybody ever seen this it's a Philip Clark, not autographed. Wow. That is kind of hilarious. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Blue Jays. That is kind of funny. They just straight up not signed it. That If that's not a one-on-one, I don't know what is. That is pretty crazy. I mean, yeah, luckily you can get in touch with Tops, And, you know, there's a recording of the video and stuff. So they will take care of you. Uh, all you got to do, I'll keep one of these packs. And I'll send it to you with the Blue Jays. Uh, that way you can get in touch with them. And you can also, uh, you know, reference the video here as well. So they'll, uh, they'll replace it for you. They will replace it for you. So I'll put that aside there for you. That, wow, that's, uh, that is nuts. I know it's a bit of a hassle, Blue Jays owner, uh, but if you get in contact with Tops, they will, uh, they will replace it for you. And yeah, may, maybe, you know, they, they might just be like, you know what, our bad Here's a Jason Auto on us. If you, you play your cards right, you know that might happen. I, I've you know I've opened some Bowman in my time. I've never seen that happen. Alec Bomb to one twenty five Phillies. That's what a real Clark Auto looks like. <laughs> yeah, maybe they throw in an extra auto in here. Who knows? I don't know. Let's see. <clears throat> Mount Castle, Orioles Atomic. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> a wit auto gold sold for 4200 We hit a... Uh, we hit the one that's numbered to four ninety nine, uh, in the in the jumbo number two for the wit. I wonder what that's gonna go for. We also hit that Dominguez to two ninety nine, the Sparkle Auto. Wonder what that is gonna go for. Drew, come on now, come on. I know I know you're just teasing, but somebody might believe you. <laughs> It's allergies, damn it. Isaiah Gilliam to 150 Yankees. That's a cool looking card.
That may be, J-Man. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe the autograph is, you know, somewhere... Somewhere in the Bermuda Triangle. There. I don't know. Just, just my luck, huh? Actually, no, that has happened before. Now that I think about it, I remember I did a, uh, I opened a box of, uh, it was a football product. I think it was Origins, Origins Football. We opened the box, and it was nothing but dummy cards in it. It was, that. it was just, it was not a single card, it was all dummy cards. And dude, they they ended up they ended up sending me. Uh, they sent me a box to replace that, and then they they also sent me like like four autographs. And one of those autographs was a rookie Lamar Jackson, which at the time wasn't a big deal, but now kind of a big deal. Meg Muncy, 499 Dodgers. Awake in the 90s, what up? Bobby Wood Jr., Royal Space. You know, ripping a little Bowman on uh, on Bowman Day. Imagine if that happened to to a Dominguez card. That that do you, you guys think that might be worth more? Probably not. But it is an error. Somebody will probably pay for it. Look at my look at my Dominguez auto with the invisible ink, bruh. We got a Dominguez Yankees uh insert here. Right, like it's exactly that's that's what I was thinking, Tim. Yeah, these ninety Bowman cards are super cool. <laughs> Freak, that'd be great. You know, they might put on the slab like, oh, error card or something. You know, uh, I don't know if they actually do that, but that would be kind of cool. Maybe it's uh, maybe it's Bowman's brand new uh, product where they're like, hey, you know, get it autographed your damn self. <laughs> You know, I mean, you could show up to spring training and be like, hey, dude, you forgot to sign it. And then he could sign it and be like 101 or something. That would be really cool. If you could show up to spring training and be like, hey, man, sign this card for me, bro. You 
have him sign it COVID-19 or something. What are you playing, a video game or something awake? Maybe a little softball, softball action? Speaking of, last box mojo. Yeah, G Money, yeah, it did. Yeah, it surely did. Ah, gotcha. I mean, awake. Listen, it's it's like I tell people all the time. Listen, if if you if you sh if you go to eat at McDonald's, you know there's a strong chance you'll probably go to Taco Bell or Burger King too. You know, it's just it, it is what it is. It's like you know, if if I'm going shopping, I'm not only just gonna go to Foot Locker. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go to Foot Action, see what they got. I'm gonna go to Champ, see what they got. You know. never said that. Ah, dude, Champ, yo, Champs used to, at, at least back in the day, here in, uh, in good old Miami, Florida, back when I was in middle school, we used to go to Champs and buy the long tees that they had. And they used to sell them like three for like $10 or something like that. And, dude, I had them in like, I had them in every color. I had them in black, white, blue, gray, red, green, yellow. It was just, oh, man. The good old days. Back when South Pole and Echo were like dope. Uh, you know, that is, uh, that's, that is, you know, I can't ignore that. I cannot ignore that. It's not this, although, you know, cool. Uh, Jorge Mateo, 499 A's. I think it's a printing plate or something. It's coming up. Save it for the end? All right, fair enough. Fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I guess. I mean, listen, the, the dude is going to get that Blue Jays autograph one way or the other. He He's just got to go through the extra hassle of, you know, filling out that form and uh, getting in contact with uh, Tops and whatnot. Well, that could have been Dominguez, and it could potentially be bigger. Who knows? I don't know. Either way, Yankees do get a hit. Ezekiel Duran with the Yankees auto. It's his first Bowman, too. Could be a big one. And it's the Yankees, too, so you know how that goes. And there, there's that uh, 
printing plate that's still to be had. Got a Sam Huff, Rangers Atomic. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a plate, uh, JMS. But I was told to leave it uh, for last, so. That's what I'm going to do. To answer your question, though, uh, Andrew, uh, I did not leave the sticker on. But uh, I do leave the sticker on for the new era uh, caps. Which, I don't know why that's a thing. But it's definitely a, a thing. You got to leave that new era sticker on there. And that's not the only product they got pushed back, Jordan. They, uh, I heard that Contenders draft picks also got pushed back. There's a Pauzon A's. Uh -uh. First Bowman base. There's a Chrome Poisson A's. You know, random thought here, but 7-Eleven makes pretty good pizza. You can get a large pizza at a 7-Eleven for like, like $7. It's, it's a lot better than the Little Caesars pizza, I'll tell you that. Ah, oh, wake in the nineties, man. Go for it. Go for it. What about a cutie pizza? What the hell is that? Yeah, I can't I can't deny that, Jameis. I cannot deny that. It's really good bang for your buck. But you you know, you gotta get it freshly made. That that is when it's you know at its at its peak uh, deliciousness. Joey Votto two fifty Reds. Jordan, whoa, who are you talking to like that? <laughs> it better be Louise you talking to like that. Let me find out. 
Ah, a Dominguez paper. Been a while. I got your back, Louise. I got your back. Team Louise over here. What you doing, babe? Like I, that's how that's how I read it. What you doing, baby? Oh, nothing. You know, hanging out with Uncle Jesse. Again? You're always hanging out with your Uncle Jesse, man. All right, let's see uh, what this plate's about. It's a Red Sox. Brian Mata. Red Sox printing plate. A yellow printing plate. One of one mojo. Now, 101s, that is considered a hit. Man, Don has been on, on a pretty crazy heater today. I, I truly hope he plays the lottery. All right, so that is going to do it. All right, let's uh, start our recap with these. The, uh, the Dominga Sensation. Got two paper base. Got a chrome insert and an atomic for uh, Mr. Dominguez of the Yankees there. Uh, let's see. I'll save those for later. Let's look at our uh, numbered cards, but let me put these aside. All right, so these atomics are not numbered, but they're nice to look at. Lutz. Kate, Rutherford, later Brad, uh, Mountcastle, and Huff. Number cards, we got Votto 250, Mateo 499, Muncie 499, Gilliam 150, Baum 125, Belazovic 499, Sejas 499, Urena 499, Madrigal 125, Blade 150, Vargas 499, Logan Gilbert to 25, just the Sheffield to 150, and Davis to 125 Cubs. Now for the autos. Well, not an autograph, but it is a one-on-one -on -one printing plate. Brian Mata, Red Sox. Now check this funkiness out. Philip Clark, but where's the auto? Uh, quite clearly an error. So uh, let's see, the Blue Jays owner, Gregory. All you got to do is, uh, I believe, through the Tops website, uh, you'll be able to, uh, like, file a claim. I have, I will provide a, a pack for you, which is what you need to file that claim so that they can either send you a replacement for this card or, uh, or something of equal value. All right. All right. Autographs. We've got Ezekiel Duran, Yankees. Not numbered. Luis Patino, Padres, four ninety nine. Tariq Skubal, Tigers, one fifty. Eric Rivera, Angels, two ninety nine. And Jacob Amaya, Dodgers, four ninety nine. And that's gonna do it for the break. Thank you, everybody. We'll get it out to you.